Hello everybody, it's Justin Place Gaming here, and we're here for another cat present. As you can see, it says bad ending on the screen. It's because I figured out I can uh, look at the other endings. So I'm going to look at those. Frisky, you've been looking at a lot of mean things about me recently. And you know what, Champagne? I think you should <laughs> constantly the fact that you have a huge question. What? I do not. Please, a fake Frisky story. And the only reason you threaten to do that is because you... I... Don't be ashamed. I want to be with you. No, that's not true. Why not? You're a gorgeous cat and huggable. I turned off. You think I'm a hungry power maniac and the truth is the only thing I'm hungry is for you. It's true. Speak on cat span. Wonderful politician, I know how to meet you. So you launch a presidential campaign in order to get into my good graces. Yes, the campaign is just an excuse so I can be with you. Because I'm ridiculously attracted to you. Campaign, I I think you uh let's Zero old on the floor. I left the office before things got too inappropriate. I'm not in the in, interested in the mechanics of now. Cats reproduce. Following week got the nomination. He named Champagne as his vice president. At the same time, Camp Champagne nominated Frisket as her vice president. Now what happens is two of them will end up in the White House together. Them and their fifteen kittens. Yes. Engagement. Merge was worth fired, including me. Sorry, Milk, but has her own people in charge of schedule and have actual experience, unlike you. Have experience, I worked for you like two weeks. And every day you took a three hour break. You think I didn't notice, did you? I should fire you just for that. But I have no other job. I'll be unemployed and broke again. I'm sorry. Truth is, I like you. If you haven't taught me all that love, and what's like, I never know the champagne's the one for me, but she wants you gone, and so you have to go. Goodbye. This is sad. I was fired. That's another person, so I had to move back to my parents' business. Like my, I predicted, I got it sold. She spent all the money already, so I didn't get to see a dime. Became president of the United States, and it served for eight years with her husband, Frisky, as VP. For, for another eight years, was Champagne as his. He'd be the strongest and long lived political powerhouse in this country you've ever seen. Our Frisky Jr. can't be the second political dynasty who will last for a long time. I guess that's the end of my story. I worked for Frisky. He has some bleak romantic turmoil, but before you met his true love, I was almost forgotten. Um, already forgotten. I don't hold it against him. Can never send away of politics. That was a bad ending. Endings. So let's see what the normal ending. Because we got the good ending, so y'all saw that. I just want to see what all of them. This is the normal. I'll do it. Whatever you want. Yes, don't do it, Frisky. Kick this cat out of your office. Haha, <laughs> there's nothing you can do to get rid of me. Oh yeah, I know a cat's secret weakness. Cucumbers! You have a cucumber in here? In order to get rid of champagne. But what do you do about... That was your campaign. Oh, no, I got this. Um, um, I've already got this, so I got the normal ending, and so I can't look at the great ending, because I don't, okay, Dr. Nanos, we got the good ending, let me look, I, I just want to see, oh, yeah, so I did get this, okay, Okay, so I'm going to look at the normal and the, uh, the other one first. So this is going to be kind of a little bit longer than the other ones because I'm looking at the other things. Really? Blah, 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 blah. So, blah, 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 blah. Oh my gosh, I've already done this. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So let's go back to Dr. Nanos. Looks like the normal ending. Thank you. You're not mad? Oh, I'm mad. All right, but I'm also grateful. This will help expose some of the corruption in the political system. You united me with my father, not for very long, though. I met because I imagine you'll be arrested. Arrested? We did break the law, kind of. Sickly met it with the cannon, and consorted them to quitting the race. That's definitely against the official Sharp Claw Handbook. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. It's not your fault. 
My father is a career cr criminal. That I finally know. My father is. This is a real weight off my chest. I'm glad to hear it, but about the nomination? Yeah, about that. You know to lose, but I can't help myself. I just can't see you lose. I had to intervene. Why? Because you do deserve. And if you don't, then you... You, you, maybe you don't, but you're the c c cat this country needs. You're loyal, honest, and you're you're gonna love you. Transform our country and make us a better nation. That way, I know you felt that way. Sorry, I didn't mean to overwhelm you. It's just been an emotional day. No, I'm glad. I enjoy your honesty. It's one thing I like about you. Just wow, you love me that much. They went too far, so I'm sorry. Keep apologizing, but you don't have to. You keep you can't help the way you feel. Also, the truth is, I love you too. Oh, really? Maybe not in a romantic way, but as a friend? Well, definitely. When I fired you, it made me really sad. I'm just gonna tell you, but I'm up for days about it. I don't really like hurting people in general, but hurting you? That was especially difficult. If it came a couple, start started doing something like that, I think there's potential. I think our love can grow. So you want to be a couple? I want to try, at least. I really want to try, because I don't want to let an amazing woman like you slip me through my boss. Oh, Doctor, now I'm- now I'm- oh, name I- no, this is wrong. I can't start it with you. Why not? Because I'm a failure of a cat. I won that election by accident. If I dated you, I'd force you to the spotlight and turn your whole life upside down. It's not fair to you. I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, you're not getting the way that easy, doctor. You know, because isn't he the greatest cat ever? On first date, take the so. Trasulov continued. Oh, the way he would turn to say the exact same thing. Oh, uh, so this is it's the same thing. And that was a real winner. Does you get the presidency though? Okay, so it doesn't say if we got the presidency or not. So let's look at the bad ending. What were you thinking? I, you know, you wanted to lose a campaign. If I told you that over a hundred times, heck, I even fired you for making my campaign central. Why didn't you get the message? I never seen him so angry. I'm sorry. I just thought, thought what? You thought I'd be happy if you intervened and kept the campaign going? You were wrong. I'm sorry. Guess what? I don't care. You just ruined my life, name. You think I'm going to forgive you? You're delusional. I wanted to quit. I wanted to go home. I wanted to retire, but no. You had to step in at the last second. Convince my father to bend the rules. Are you an idiot? You tried to ruin my life, dad's life, and mine. I know that Socks was your father. I did. Socks told me when I started this campaign, it was the perfect scheme. I spent months, months, creating this fake nice guy personal. Too nice to win the nomination, dad said. And he was right. I should have lost. Now thanks to you, everything has come crashing down on our heads. Now people know that stuff's not related. I can't crash in on the deal. It's come to nothing. 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 I hate any, any even more than I hate anybody else in my entire life. Wait, are you saying your nice personality was a lie? Of course it was a lie. No one's that nice to everybody all the time. What, what are you? An idiot? Cats only cut out the people when they want something. Doesn't want you anymore. Out come the claws. Rawr. You scratch me, Dr. Noms, you no, you're supposed to be my friend. Friend, I don't have friends. There's no one I can count. Count on. Beside myself, everyone else is a toy for my amusement, like Lizzie. Shock. What did you do to Lizzie? Oh, she didn't tell you? Ha, what a waste. What did you do, my best friend? I got her fifth cat in two months and a new record for me. Why did what did she tell you? Something else? Something like we tried, but it just didn't work out. You You were horrible. And my father's son and you and he and I got to the top of the political world through manipulation, exploit, and exploration. We do the same thing too. What? I hope you enjoy having your house committed, your tax go up. Oh, the interference pay you got from me considered cancelled. I'm gonna ruin your life, just like you ruined mine. I don't want to hear one anymore. I ran away, Klein. Dr. Nam was good as his word, or as bad as his word. He, sh I should say, he did everything in his power to make my life miserable. And the, th that, the thing is, he had a lot of power and influence to extend. I ended up moving with Lizzie. She, we helped raise our kids together. We, when they grew up to ask about their father, we told them their dad was dead. So Dr. Nam knows again, and frankly, I didn't want to. He went to become president, and his approval ratings were among the highest ever. Did the truth about him. So that was that. So, I think for, so we're going to do a new, can I load one? No. Okay. Oh. Okay, so we're gonna do a new one, and, um, okay, so my name is gonna be 
Kale's assistant. Because we're gonna go for Kale this time. Um, I love cats. I can't wait to see them. Neither blah 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 blah. As you see, I can just skip all of this. I'm gonna vote for Kale. So go with Kale. Let's go. And what should we explore? What an actual campaign manager is. Is that celery? <laughs> should I go with Kale? He seemed like the right choice for me. I like to work for Kale. That's a okay. Kale's assistant. <laughs> oh, wonderful! Welcome to the Kale campaign. Aw, and you wanted her to work for me. Doesn't matter how many managers you hire, Kale. You're still a loser, a nobody. That brings an end to tonight's sharp cloud debate. Thank you for all for very much. What? Uh, thank you all for watching. I had my first middle meeting with Kale back in his hotel room. <gasps> Look at the key. Oh my goodness. Kale's assistant. I'm glad you have <laughs> working on my campaign. I figured some fresh blood can help us with our problems. What problems? You seem to be doing well to me. Thanks for saying that, but this campaign is going to be an uphill battle. There's dozens of cats trying to get where I am. Dozens? I don't understand. I thought there were only six. You and the other people who were there at the debate tonight, right? Oh, you don't know? Oh dear. According to the new laws, every state gets one candidate to represent it. Which means there's 50 cats. 50? Tonight's debate was the top six according to the polls. Oh well that's good news, you're in the top six. Not really, of the six I'm dead last. Only 3.24 of the vote. The 70 last, the 17th place cat got 3.23. 3. 0.1%, that's not much of a lead. I know right, the worst part is I had, I had a 2% firm margin. So all we know, I'm dead last. <sighs> I'm sorry, I should have told you before except me as my manager. If you'd rather campaign for one of the other popular candidates, I want to stick to you to the bitter end. Really? You bet. I said to be your campaign manager and I admit it. Just because it's difficult doesn't mean I should quit before it even gets started. I know I made the right choice in hiring you. With you on the campaign, there's no way we can lose. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Especially with that kid right there. Yeah, yeah. How do you run a political campaign anyways? As you know, first primary is tomorrow. We focus all our attention on that. Um, yeah, right. I knew totally about that. So the primary is in, uh, Miyama. Yeah, that's right. Right, Miyama. That's a southern primary state. No, it's a western one. Right, right, right. Why didn't I pay more attention during high school? I can barely remember all this stuff. Hmm, I think we were over this in Drew's history class. I'm gonna wait. Cause nobody cares, that's why. <laughs> Oops, that's me. Kale's assistant, no cell phones in class. Please answer me. Government stuff isn't that important anyways. Campaign manager for presidential day. You'd be completely unprepared if you don't know this stuff. Yeah, right, that could never happen. Wow, not that thick about it. Mr. Drew was right. History can be important. I guess I should study my high school history book to learn about elections. It's about Washington to poopsie. It was brand new. I tried selling it back to school. They offered me four bucks. It's kind of about that. So it's in the back of my college collecting dust. I said thank you for letting me join you in his campaign. Then I went and picked up my old history book. Yama, uh, uh, Miyawa's in the western most state in the entire world and country. Its residency is mostly farmers who struggle with a hostile environment, even more hostile land squatters. Medicine is scarce, and people live fear live in fear of deadly diseases like smallpox, chloria, and dysentery. Uh, this information by a little bit out of date, but it seems like it could be useful. You know, are so scared of smallpox that if we try and make, we should. Um, uh, just make the cornerstone of Kale's campaign. A vote for Kale is a vote against okay. Smallpox. Vote Kale and bring more doctors in Miyama. Yeah, that seems perfect. You mean perfect. It's, t it's getting late. Maybe I should go to bed. It's literally still light outside. Let's do more research. No, I can't go to sleep yet. I need to do more research for s Kale. 
Um, let's see. Capital of Meow is Dis Meows. It's the largest city in the entire state. Yeah, we should go campaigning in Dis Meows. That way, can we reach as many people and cats as possible? What a great strategy! Kale will be so proud of me for thinking of just a genius plan. Maybe campaigning in this is completely obvious, but give me a break. It's my first day on the job, and besides, I was sleepy. I don't want to have to turn it off and I went to bed. I know good when it comes to politics. I know a lot of gives those speeches. So one of the uh, visit was a speech website. You know, one of those where people post requests for speeches. One of the requests was teacher association. What did for hour long speech on long division for fourth grader? I signed Kale up to get that speech. Teachers are an important voting block, right? I don't know if Kale could talk about long division for an hour though. Are cats good at math? I hope they are. I met with in the airport. Hi, Kale's assistant. Ready to visit Miyama? You bet. Before you leave, though, I have a question. Are you good at math? Specifically, are you good at long division? Not really. I do clock later for math problems. That's kind of an odd question. Why do you ask? Well, um, I signed you up to talk about long division for an hour at a teach, teach association. What? I don't know anything about long division. Sorry, Kale. I thought it would help you in the lyrics, and I guess I should have asked you about it first. Don't feel bad. I appreciate your help. Maybe this will work out for the best. When is the speech supposed to happen? 3 o'clock right after school ends. Hmm, we might be able to make that work. I have charity lunch on at 1 and 2, and obviously the minor debate is at 5, but that's all I have going on this afternoon. Minor debate? What's that? The debate with the lower rank candidates. Didn't you get the email about it? No, I'm not on the email list about it. Oh dear, we need to fix that. We also need to research long division. I can do that on the plane flight to Miyama. Great. In case I didn't say this, I'm really grateful to have you working on my campaign. Kale's assistant. Got a lot of energy and enthusiasm, and I just thinking. I'm glad to be working on the campaign, too. And so when it came to the speech, but didn't seem upset about it. He's a really nice cat. I'm lucky he gave me a job. Started to start the campaign, but I was looking forward to the rest of the day. Little did I know how, long, how badly the Myanmar primary would go. Which we finally understand why we need to learn stuff that we didn't learn that we didn't learn in grade school. On the way to me, I wrote three pages of note on long division. I gave them to Kale so he could memorize them. He said he couldn't read my handwriting, so he made me rewrite the notes on computer. Most of the morning was spent getting to town meeting with the fat cats. To be honest, I didn't pay much attention. I was still jet lagged. We can't went to the teachers association meeting. I was surprised to find a familiar face in the audience. Kale's assistant. Oh my gosh, it's my old history teacher, Mr. Drew. Hey, Mr. Drew, I haven't seen you in 40 years. Well, five years, five. Oh yeah, that's right. It would be five years, wouldn't it? You were always bad at math. Are you giving a speech about long fish? No, I'm not giving this speech. Kale is giving it. Oh, I see. You found that you're running a presidential campaign, given that you failed the section on U.S. Hunter. I didn't fail, did I? You remember the question about political primaries? You said there was 1,776. Oops. Then you know how your primaries do it. Um, there's, there's three primaries. One of me, one of me, Mork, and one in Taco Bell. You write about the three primaries, but wrong where where they are. Looks like you improved a little. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Thank you, Mr. Joe. You're the best. Don't forget to vote for Kale. Thank you. Good luck. You'll need it. Vote for Kale. I didn't need a luck. I knew Kale would win the election. Even some voters can't tell the difference between him and the other 49 candidates. 49 candidates. That's a lot of competition. Luckily, I had a secret weapon. You know all the research I did last night? Put a lot of information to that speech to make it extra perfect. Now, it would be sure to impress everybody in Miyama. You just, I'm honored to speak for you today on Long Division, the most important subjects that face fourth graders in our country, and indeed the entire world. But tonight, I will begin to mention another in issue that concerns all Meowans. Smallpox! Taking far too many lives. We must eliminate this deadly of these. A vote for Kale is a vote against Smallpox. Vote for Kale, I'll bring more doctors to Meowma. I, hey, wait a second, is this a joke? Who put about speech about Smallpox in my notes? That, that disease was cured in 1980. Um, I was out of date or misread it or something. I was terrible. This must stick. This big dates to teachers. I was upset and had things fix this problem. So I started cheering. Whoa, whoa, hooray for Kale. He cured small fox. Kale, 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 Kale,
It's Mr. True. Kale, 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 kale. All the teachers. Kale, 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 kale. It wasn't a bad. <laughs> such a bad person after all. Thank you very much for your support, everyone. Now let's get to the topic again. Long division. The topic is very near and clear to, dear to my heart. It's always my belief we not should let dividends and divisors so separate us from each other. If I'm elected. If I'm elected president, I will ensure that you only remain as a truth judgment and rubber chew toys. But what is long division? If we go back to the major pages of history, we do, we find that division has always been. I stopped paying attention to the speech after that, but it seemed really impressed. After everything was ever, I made a point talk to Mr. Drew. Hey, Mr. Drew, thanks for helping with the cheer. You're welcome, Kale's assistant. I'm surprised though, I thought you didn't like me. I think you're a bad student, but you got a good heart. I don't want to see you lose your job on the first day. So you were in five classes here, so I'm not going to hold a grudge against you that long just because you didn't turn in your homework. Oh, gee, I love you too, Mr. Drew. <laughs> I think there's a man you love more, or should I say, cat. Huh, what are you talking about? Sort of, you sort of feeling in time, I'm sure. Good luck, Gail's assistant. Oh my gosh. It's gonna happen. That was weird. What cat could I fall in love with? Him. Hey, Gail's assistant. Ready to go? Oh, hi, Gail. I love your speech. You're just a great speaker. Thank you, yourself. You wrote most of my speech. Yeah, but your delivery was perfect. I bet you're gonna wipe the floor with everybody else at the debate tonight. I hope so. I spent the next hour preparing for a minor debate. The thing was to silly call it a minor debate when the majority of the candidates were there, but that's po politics for you. They were there, except for the fun that were in the previous debate. Talked about a packed house. I held my breath as, as the debate began. It was a breakthrough moment for Kale. Everyone wants to see how wonderful it is, and you vote for him in the primary. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the minor debate for the Shop Club Party. How today? Being held today of the Miyama primary. This is your last chance to see candidates before the close close of seven, so let's get started. We have a lot of candidates to meet and a lot of topics to discuss. First, we start with Senator Barkley. Senator, what is your opinion on current tax rate? It's a little bit higher. It's a little bit higher than it should be. But hey, you know, what you gonna do? You gotta pay for schools. Senator Bradley, your response? I believe that the other senator has gone wild and lost his mind. Taxes are far too high. Sir, Senator Ewing, your response. Taxes to fund schools are not high enough. We need to turn it up. Congrat, Congressman Bogus. For the current budget, I burn it up. Turn on the floor of the Senate and make them start over. Wrong. I voted for that budget once and I'll vote for it again. Please do not speak out of turn. The next question for Mr. Jordan. We would like for the to start to get worried. When was Kale going to be able to speak? Finally, Mona reached Kale by name. Senator Kale, do you think voting is important? Yes, I believe. Thank you, Senator Kale. Senator Bird, what is your opinion on the European Union? It's in three words before they cut him off. Man, I turned 45 candidates in one hour. That's super unfair. It's such a good cat. He says more time than that. That's sad, too. Start cheering for Kale. I'm trying to cheer. Maybe I'll start again. Kale! 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 Shh, I'll have the bait. Yes, be quiet. Aww. I should have debate went badly. Never got a second chance to speak. You know what Kale was saying earlier, how can't tell the difference between him and the other candidates. Obviously, he's different from all the candidates because he's the best choice, but no one would know about that if he doesn't get any publicity. I wonder how he decided to hire me as new campaign manager. He needs something new. Something different. Something to make him stand above the crowd. I wish I knew that. How can I help anybody learn direct? Policies are the best. And what are policies, by the way? I'm going to look them up on the flight of Miyama, but I got forgot. I guess I'm not that good of a campaign measure. Well, well. Maybe you'll get some name recognition from being in the earlier debate. That'll help, right? Maybe they'll list the name first on the ballot. I know yeah, whoever is listed first. That's what I did in high school, and there was multiple just question of the answer to. Come think of it, that's probably why I failed a lot of the tests in Mr. Drew's history class. You know, the point is that Kale's campaign is not doing as well as I hoped. I to be in the lead, not hovering around on names face of a debate to help go determined when this size the only and we're on this, how to be a campaign manager. Got a lot of great ideas. Can't wait to share them with Kale tomorrow. Sweet shot. Oh, that's a piece of kale. Take clear important points about the platform, such as what is our platform? That's a piece of kale, and he's kale. 
I see what they did there. Good morning, Kale. It's not that good of a morning. Why not? You clearly haven't seen the results of the primary. Well, you gave the awesome speech yesterday, and I'm sure the results will be positive. <laughs> positive, you get it? Because you start going to school? I mean, the, sure, the debate wasn't the greatest, but hey, look at the results. Tenth place? Down from sixth place. That's a drop of four. Oh, no, I'm sorry. At least you got higher than 39 other candidates. So I look again. What can you be talking about since you're here? And... There was four-way tie for 10th place. And then with all those candidates losing 2.3, there's a tie for 2.2 and then 2.1. Hey, you creamed the 0.3 candidates. Same problem I've always had. Get this decision and I saw for other candidates. Now when there's so many cats running for office, it's a tough shot. It's like herding cats. Excuse me? Herding cats? It's just an expression. Horrible outdated expression. Never to use it again. Okay, next I'm gonna say different. After all, there's more than one way to skin a cat. Now you're trying to make me upset. Exxon's trying to distract you from your poll numbers. Did it work? No, but thanks anyways. <laughs> you should do next and next primary. Better than the next primary. After all, I only had one day to prepare for Meowma. Not not a lot of time for a brand new campaign manager, to, you know. But North and North Duck lost primaries in three weeks. That'll give us pretty, plenty of time to make us the winning sheriff for that say. I've already thought of some ideas. Me too, but you're wrong. Excuse me? Next primary is a new closure. It's in three days, not three weeks. Whoa, what? We have another primary in less than a week and I haven't had enough time to recover from the last one. Me neither. Maybe we should drop out of the race. Okay, I'll just keep going. You have to keep going. You can't quit just because it's tough. I think of all the people in your home state of Pennsylvania. They've been waiting hundreds of years for a president from their state. You can't let them down. First of all, James Bucketclaw was from Pennsylvania. Second of, second of, I'm from Jersey. Really? You don't have an accent. Look, Kale's assistant, do you do any research before joining my campaign? Well, thought, well, I thought I figured you were from Pennsylvania. But actually, I did some research last night. That's what I've been trying to get to. See, there's, what we need is a way to make you look different. Make you different. To make you, to, you need to stand out above the crowd, even if you got to shout loud. That's what I've been saying all along. Once people need to know your personality, in politics, they'll love you. We just need to figure out a way to get their attention. My policies? Yeah, like what do you do for to support ta tax reform foreign education? Well, about government infrastructure. <sighs> What's wrong? I got bad news, Kale's assistant. I don't really don't have any policies. You what? That is to say, I don't that I don't have anything that makes me different or unique from the other candidates. Every time we do work in the Senate, I vote, a lot, I vote along party lines. Why? Because I'm running for president. Everyone knows that the most moderate ca candidate in the primary is the one who gets the nomination. Fringe candidates might be popular for a little while, but they end up alienating the base. That's the catechin appeal to the most people. So I don't try any weird or different policies like a 30% tax tax rate or outline pantyhose that would make that could make voters upset with me but I see I see but this time I get to tell you you're wrong excuse me I checked out the issue policies last night and you get an average scratch on your issues but your score for scratching post enthusiasts is through your roof really yeah voters really love your stance on scratching posts it's your most popular topic it's not hundred percent true denounce Smallpox is a major threat. Somebody put a video on that. It got 2,000 views. It became most, most requested. Uh, it's not a joke. I'm pretty sure it's a joke though, so I ignored it and went through the second most popular topic. The improvement rate is through scotching is 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 a is enthused. It's a mind blowing 98. We need to capitalize on that. Are you sure? I don't think you want to like on scratching posters. I get a few single issued voters, but they can't carry the day. And, General elections, but they can build up more momentum for you. I was discussing with most people, they would get excited too. Like, who's the, who's that cat? One of the amazing followers and excited crowd. I want to follow him too. He should be my president. Are you sure? Absolutely. When people learn how great they are, they'll vote for you, just like me. I mean, I never even heard for you, dude, gays. And look at me, I'm a huge kale fan girl. That's what we need an army of fan girls. <laughs> a huge group of people who vote for you and convince everybody else to vote for you. They just need to learn who I am first. Right, and that's why we're starting with your most popular. 
topic, uh, scratching process. That's, I just know how to begin. I'll send you up to give a speech on scratching process. That way you'll be in the huge crowds of scale reporters. It will look great on, ev on the evening news. I hear the news will report on the event. I'll find a bunch of reporters. What about the people who write clickbait articles on the internet? Hmm. Never read those articles, so they're trash, but based on the pictures, they're mostly about women in bikinis. Maybe I could show up in my swimsuit. That could get their attention. Um, I don't think it would be a good idea in a swimsuit. Why not? The article probably writes itself. You can't believe what Kale's manager wore to the swimsuit. I'm not going to get votes by causing a scandal. I uh, see. That's why I like you. You're a good, honest can candidate. Um, but, um... I, mean, I didn't mention bikinis because I thought I would get first. I mentioned them because it's well, it's kind of a long story. See, my last done before I sang my swimsuit was too hideous. He stole it, set it from fire, and flat how ugly it was. It was a, it was a real traumatizing experience for me. I haven't worn a swimsuit since. Guess you can say I'm too scared to. What if more people hate it and think I can't dress myself? For some reason I don't know. I cared about Kill's opinion on the topic, like if he. Thought my since it was nice, or it would just cancel out. You know, it cancel out the one jerk. He thought my swimsuit was awful, but that probably says dude. He's such a nice guy. He wouldn't be me. I can trust him, right? Here we go. Perfect. I mean, perfect. Sorry, I'm spit out for a second. Good. I'm gonna look up things on my phone and guess what? There's a big scratching post convention in the new closet in the morning. Cats and people from all over the planet attend and they'll be showcasing over 400 types of scratching posts. Bingo! That's what the convention plays a keynote from a popular president candidate. That is great. I could, if only I could, it could be an amazing turning point in my campaign. See, it told you you couldn't quit this early. Keep trying your best and good things will happen. I know. I'm sorry if I get a little sad sometimes. It's just I've been campaigning for 10 months now. Sometimes it gets a little weirding, but that only makes me, but that only makes me glad I hired you. Some fresh advice is exactly what this campaign needs. No, Kale, what this campaign needs is you. Lots and lots of you, because you're going to win over the voters, not me. Um, that's true. Kale is such a cool cat. I also hope Kale will win. I knew in my heart that he was the best cat to be in the president of the United States. Little did I know that go even worse than the one in Miawa. Which, what do you mean? The other person working on the campaign, and instantly I hate everything about them. Yeah, what is Lizzie in all of this? And booked a hotel. And then we built a pillow fort in the hotel room. And it doesn't sound like we did much. We we're talking while we we're building. We came with a solid plan for the next three days. So we make speeches, meet with people, and volunteer at a homeless cat shelter. The purpose of the plan was scratching. Vote convention, that would be the big thing. The thing that got everything, everyone's attention. Was it too late to add a scratching post to Kale's logo? Right now, the logo's sort of a vegetable. Reminds me, you put something on his web about eating healthy. We we, it's important to let no let people know to eat right. That's why he's such a, he cares about people. He cares about the... Who's this? Here's your coffee, Mr. Kale. Thanks, Bernice. Good luck with the convention today. We're all rooting for you. Who was that? Oh, that's Bernice. She's my secretary. You have a secretary? Of course. What do you think writes all the letters I sent out? I, um, no, I thought I was the only person who was working on the campaign. Bernice has been for years now. It's the very beginning. I thought you didn't know her joke just now. Have you gotten any of her emails? No. Well, ask Bernice to add you to the email list. I'll make sure to do that. Okay, I'll do that right away. I was lying, of course. No way to talk to that Bernice lady. Couldn't believe it. I thought I was the only person working on the campaign. I thought I was Kale's main support. His leading lady. And all this time he's had Bernice with him? Probably likes her better than me. She's much older and more accomplished than me. Plus, I bet she's smart. Guys always like smart women. Me? I'm not that very smart. I don't know why, but I was instantly jealous of Bernice and how close she was to Kale. I'm mean, getting him coffee next thing, he should be going through his mail, taking his phone calls. Then they get Bernice and be a goodbye. Kale says, Hello, Miss Bernice Kale. I don't know why the idea pressed me so much, but it did. But Kale fired his old campaign manager because they were running out of money. But apparently, he kept Bernice on the payroll. But it keeps stopping him from 
firing me and replacing me with Bernice, what if? Okay, then it would never replace me, would he? How's the coffee? The one that Bernice gave you. It looked cold. Ah, I knew it. Is come here, come here, just hold a second. I'll get you a new coffee. Good one. But not much else. Do best if they sell one product. Hey, what can I get you? Decaffeinated. I get decaf, please. I don't want to get the, uh, what's the difference? Large size comes are bigger so than $7 more, which is bigger as, um, a quarter of an ounce. I'll take the normal. The normal. I don't get it. Catnip. Once I got the coffee, I ran back to the hotel and gave it to Kale. Here you go, Kale. Fresh coffee. Coffee from your number one employee. That's okay. I already finished the other coffee and Drink it, drink it, drink it. Okay, if you insist. Yowz, is this decaf coffee? I saved $7 for a campaign, too. That's great, but I don't drink decaf. It always gives me a headache. Um, it does. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. I can go get you another one. It's okay, you, you can drink this coffee. No, no, I need to get going anyways. Can't be late for my appearance at the mall. But the other one was labeled catnip. By the way, I heard it's sometimes good if you're late. What? Balls up excitement and petition. That's why I'm 10 minutes late for everything, including the children's birthday. I don't have any children. You don't? Yeah, I guess I never found the right moon to settle down with. Why is my it's only being faster? You spend too much time focusing on politics, not focusing enough on life. I'm... I'm sure you'll find a good... <laughs> girlfriend soon, as long as it's not pretty. Ah, well, we're getting off topic. Shall we go? Yes, sir. Uh, shouldn't have chose that. No. My advice, ten minutes late, but... Without us, he he said. I thought you weren't coming. I thought this was dumb. After all, we went to nearby college for Kelly to get a speech. Free thinkers club was criticizing mainstream ideas. The policy is question anything and everything except themselves. Kill told them that they need to think for themselves and instead of letting them tell them how to think. It was good. Told them to and understand, but it made a big hit. All the free Think it was cheered. Well, wow, Kale, that went really well. You're a great speaker. Oh, I didn't do anything special. I just told the people what they needed to hear. That's half of politics. You're not very good at it. I don't realize you shouldn't say stuff like that to liberal art majors. Really, what should you say to liberal art majors? Have a double latte with extra foam. Wait, really? Is that what the coffee I should have ordered this morning? No, that was a joke. A good political campaign is to tell what they are in the point. To the future of this country, no matter what they're studying. Even if they study underwater basket weaving. Yep, I don't want to at the backbone of America's country, just one of those really parts of the backbone that nobody really knows about. Are you saying that you're willing to be dishonest in order to get reelected? Of course not. I think baskets are great. I think baskets are great too. We have so much in common. See, Mr. Senator Kill, I have a question about student loan debt. Oh, for, you see, I owe $400,000 in college tuition. And I'm still two years from graduation. Is there anything you can do to help improve my situation? I believe that. Ooh, I know this one. We should make college free. College free for everyone. Really, that's a great idea. If so everyone has a college education, then everybody will find a job. Pretty sure that's how it works. It's a win-win scenario. Exactly. It's, it's super cheap. And I'm sure the taxes won't go up that much. Thanks. I'm totally voting for Kale now. Good job talking that sooner. That's another vote for me. Thanks, Kale. Learn from the best. Ew. My gosh, look at the time. We have to leave. Now. Why are you? Oh, this crashing post convention is in 10 minutes. Now let's get to the car and hope there's not too much traffic. We're here. What should we do now? I. Not sure. They're sending me this up front. It's the organizer. I don't see anybody. There's a man over there. Excuse me, sir. Can you point us in the direction of the conven convention organizers? You're here for the scratching post convention? Yes, I'm Senator Kale and I'm giving the keynote speech. Oh, awkward. What is it? This guy was canceled due to lack of interest. They sent out a message for R4. Stay home. Guess you need to get the memo, huh? Scratchy Post is canceled, but that's the cornerstone of my campaign. The fluff kitty got. No! This is bad. I believe it. This was supposed to be Kel's breakout moment. It was canceled. What does this mean for our campaign? 
Everything is terrible. We pretend that it's not. It's over. I'm done for. I've lost the race. Please don't talk like that. What? I'm not a loser. I'm a loser. Stupid cat who's never had a chance to win. He lost me. I win. Now I'm gonna lose. Can't. So, actually, there's still two days before the primary. I bet you can rebound from this. What's the next on the on our future set schedule? I'm trying my next year movies canceled just like the convention. That convention was my big chance of talking to the thousands of people, maybe even ten thousand. But now nothing. I lost. I failed, and it's all over. Cries openly. Well, Kayla's really taking this hard. There's only one person, one person who vote for me. Maybe it'll be worth it. But I can't even. But no, I can't even get a single vote. That's not true. I'm sure your parents will vote for you, and I'll vote for you. You will. Yes, I'll vote for you. When blah, freezes over, ha! You're gonna lose no matter who you are. Then Paul's gonna kick your sorry button into the primary. You're such a pathetic hater, and I don't know why they even let you in the debates. Ha 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 ha. Don't listen to him, he's just trying to get a rise out of you. He's right, I should quit. I should go home and curl up by the heater with a bottle of warm milk. How oh, that's a crybaby. Run away from Thunderpaw. And back to the hotel, leaving me to cancel his order. It was heartbreaking, but what should I do? I was in the toilet and he had not been taken as I took over as a campaign manager. I, I've let America down. What am I saying? I can't give up yet. No, I'm going to march over to Kelsington and demand that he gets back in the race. Can't quit. Not when he's done so much and that we're so close to the end of the primary season. Okay, well, I know you're in there. Come out now. Can I help you? I, I was looking for Kale. Uh, he was completely on the other side by giving a belly rub. <clears throat> I tried to make sure that, uh, I need to make sure Kale is okay. I told you I'm taking care of him. I know him better than you do, okay? Just let me handle this. Let me handle this. No, let me in. I need to see him. Meow, yeah, what's going on? I came in to check up on you. That's very kind of you. I'm feeling better, though. See? I appreciate the concern, Kale's assistant. You're one of the good humans. I'm the kind that throws rocks at stray cats. I would never do that. I know that's part of the reason why I like you so much. Oh, me and Bernice are having a show off for Kale. Sorry about blowing up earlier. I'm better now. Good, I'm glad to hear it. But I'm not so glad Bernice covered him instead of me. See, Kale, you know, like nothing ever happened. Okay, what's the agenda for today? Breakfast with voters. Call by Burns with the Ed League. Lunch with the local union. Lunch at a nearby courthouse and early dinner with donors. I was hungry when I was made up the schedule. That's okay. Free meals help us save campaign money, which reminds me. How have been the con con contributions been recently? This is the last bit you got. Um, Two dollars. Oh, let's hope we raise more money with today's event. events. Hey, work hard that day and next day. Let's show you make a difference and touch people's life. Still, there's millions of voters in the United States of America. Fitting some one by one is inefficient. Maybe we can make a cat video with Kale and hope it goes viral on the internet. Tired for politics? Vote for Kale. The only met was happy and positive, except for one person. No. Ha. Uh, you lose are still here at Thunderpaw all the way. <gasps> that obnoxiously Thunderpaw supporters insulted us every day we've been here. Let's ignore him. Let's go back to our rooms. Why don't you give up? Nobody knows who you are. That's not true. Lots of people know who you are. Are you joking? He's a nobody. There's 40 other cats just like him. You'd be lucky if he even got a footnote in the history books. You're be quiet. Kale's a great candidate and he's trying his hardest to win, but he doesn't have a chance. He keeps going even when the odds are against him. That's what I call dedication. It's with that wonderful dedication that makes him eyes. If you don't agree with that, you can go climb up a tree. You're an idiot. We'll win New Claw Shore. You'll see. Kale will kid. Thunder pause, but from here to Washington. Now get out of my face. Fine, later, losers. Kale's assistant. That was really brave of you to defend me in front of that violent person. It was the right thing to do, not because you're my boss, because I truly believe you're the best candidate. You're so wonderful. I don't deserve a campaign manager like you. And once again, said, like, I had straightforward actions. So I necessarily enjoyed He was such a wonderful cat. Such a wonderful cat. I can't imagine anybody else doing a better job as president. Oh snap! I'm getting, I'm beating you, Bernice. No, no, no. New closure. 
Kale would suffer his worst defeat yet. Oh my gosh, I'm not doing so good as a campaign manager, guys. Or maybe it's just him. You can slip on something and let something slip and, and go for a walk in the rain. Oh no, sad cats. Kale's gonna be sad. Nine seventeen. Good morning. How are the, are the results? And yet, not a, all of them. Only ninety-eight of the districts have reported. In other words, the results are in. What happened? Did I win new Kloshur? Not exactly. How did I do? <laughs> well, keep in mind that was a really vote turnout. Voter turnout. A new Kloshur has a close primary. Like I said, two th the districts haven't reported yet. Quit stalling. How did I do in the primary? You got one percent of the votage. One percent? You shouldn't feel bad. Person who said that new Colossal rounds the votes counted in your percentage. You probably got 1.4. I mean, last place. Actually, no, there's a 3 way, 30 way tie. A lot of other cats got 1%, so you shouldn't feel ashamed. Oh, really? You're worse than me. The next closest candidate is, um. Who was it? Mickey Mouse. He almost lost to a cartoon character! Hey, he's a pretty famous cartoon character. It's hard to compete with somebody who has such much, so much name recognition. I mean, well, I have no name recognition because nobody has an idea who I am. This is the worst day ever. Please don't tell me you're thinking of quitting. There's no point in quitting now. They wouldn't have enough time to take my name off the ballot. But it is South Carolina, you know, it, tomorrow, you know. Wait, tomorrow? Yes, are you still not on the email list? It's not my fault, Bernie Saints. I mean, she's probably jealous of my relationship with you. And I've closely been getting over the few, few days. Excuse me? You're excited. Excuse. This doesn't make... Doesn't matter right now. What happens is you got another matters. You got another debate. Another debate. What do you mean? I got a message saying the debate is the day for the South Carolina primary. We got to hurry up and prepare. Why bother? It is so badly, do badly doing the last debate. I'm never gonna give you up. I'm never gonna give you up. Never gonna let me down. Never gonna run away from this campaign. Okay, fine. I'll prepare for the debate. Good. It's the good news of the debate will be longer than the last one. Each candidate will get this to answer two questions. Granted, that's not a lot. Maybe well, Caleb get fantastic blows the nation away. So I'm like, I plan to balance the national budget by giving everybody free candy. Does that work? If we promise candy, would people vote for this? Is that why they hold elections in November close to Halloween? No matter, I didn't have any candy to give out anyways. Even if there was candy in the area, it would be sour gumballs. Because the no matter was in a terrible mood. Let's get the farce over the debate with over. Well, hearing performance has been pitiful. Even your wife says you won't win. Why are you even here? Believe it or not, it was one of the nicer questions. To insult each and every candidate. Opposite political party, but it's going to be fair and impartial. After all, the media says they're fair and impartial, so that must be true. So, mean party will probably be fired after debates for treating candidates like dirt. But I hope at least you try to be nice to Kale. Such no look. Senator Kale, you be, used to be the sixth pop, most popular candidate, and you're at the bottom of the heat. Why haven't you dropped out of the race yet? I, um, don't want to quit because I still think I can win. You need a reality check. Governor Malone, same question. Hasn't Kale dropped out of the race yet? I can answer that question because he's afraid. Afraid to admit that he was wrong all, wrong all along. No, I meant to say. Never a net. I own sage. Maybe sadder than I have ever been in my whole life. I got a messy wall to the door. I couldn't handle anymore. Couldn't stand to watch Kill's campaign crash and burn. The cat I loved. Going to the dogs? It was too much for me to bear. Wandered lonely as a cloud through the sheets of Caroline. I walked as I sang. As I walked, I sang. Kill has fallen into the debate. And that is not great, cause I love him. I love him, and that Kale is an amazing cat. Kale, you deserve a lot of votes, and your campaign should not choke, cause it's actually a great campaign. I'm here to be your pan age man, be my uh, performance is a lack of so you deserve to be president. There's extra time and times, correct? You should lead any country with your skills to the great time through the hills. I love you more than I ever know. I'm sorry I have to go. Tomorrow we'll never see each other, and never see each other again. That is through Kale. I love you. Same, but it made no difference. There was no one here to hear me. Why a pet store? Oh gosh! It's a snake. Sale pet clothes. Did you just say pet clothes? Here we got Halloween costumes, sweater hats, all to make your design to make your pet look great. 
hat. Hat. That's what Kale needs. Cute little cat hat. I will buy a hat immediately. Whoa, don't get so excited. I got plenty of hats for sale. You want to buy the cheap one or the expensive one? Expensive. I don't care how much it costs. If it sells Kale's campaign, it's worth it. That'd be thirty dollars. Could you maybe go for twenty? Sure, I guess. The beta is passing a halftime break. Use my credentials to get back to stage. I've I don't know how we're meaning of the word quit. I don't know the meaning of credentials either. Kale. Kale, I got something for you. Why bother? This is gonna have to go to the It's the first half. Anymore, I bought you this. Meow, is this a hat? Oh, you look so cute. Everybody will love you. I don't know. Hats aren't my style. Kale, you listen to me. You only want to stand up for the other cats. Well, this is your chance. Stop being the kill to nobody and start being the cat in the hat. Are you? Are you sure? You know, I know I screwed up since I started this job, but I'm positive. There's no possible way this can backfire. Well, I guess there's no way they can get worse. And besides, it's kind of cute. See, it's perfect. I love you, Kale. You love me? I didn't mean to say it like that, I just blurted it out. I mean, uh, good luck in the bank. Choke, choke. Under questions. And then they raise the kids and start buzzing about Kale. Who is that cat? The cat with the one with the amazing hat. That's Kale! Wow, we really sticks off from the others. He looks so distinguished. Much more professional than the rest. Yeah, the other ones, the cats look like who wear a piece of bread on their head, but not Kale. He's got class. I'm the greatest politician manager ever. It is Kale's new headgear. Senator Kale, that hat looks impressive. Thank you. What is your opinion on the economy? The economy is strong. We need to find a way to improve it. We can always do better and keep going. There's no reason to quit. Even it looks like the odds are against us. That's the new Kale. So popular. And the man who gave him three extra questions. He's got a standing ovation for his response on the gold standard. People couldn't get enough of Kale. It's the best response we could hope for. If we could get this momentum going. Kale would win the presidency for sure. And what's primary has come to close, and her life is about to change forever. Kale, 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 Kale. Free stickers inside the mall. Everyone, every sticker, sticker say, "Vote for Kale." Here, have a free sticker. Vote for Kale. Wow, thanks. No problem. Hey, don't forget to vote today. Have a free sticker. Thanks a lot. I'll make sure to vote for Kale now. Wait, who's Kale? Is he the cat with the awesome hat? Because he was my favorite. That's Kale, the best dressed cat in the competition. Any cat could run that. Could run his way that well. Can run a country. Kale all the way. Kale, 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 Kale. What are you doing? I thought maybe we could start a Kale chant. I already voted today. See my sticker? Hope you voted for Kale. Actually, I think Miss Knuckle Puss is the best. Build a time machine and then go back and vote for Tail. Yes, ma'am. Great. They'll take some free stickers with you. <laughs> stickers, free stickers. Vote for Kale, the fashionable cat. <laughs> hey, Kale's assistant. Things going well? Yep. Oh my gosh, everybody. Kale is here in the mall. Kale, can you give me some fashion advice? Candace, I would pause to wear for a job interview tomorrow. Please hide my business card. Pictures, pictures, take some pictures with me and my family. Bury me, Kale. Stay away from my candidate, you crazy person. Everybody's hand took a couple of group shots. The mouse carried the cloud and scored, helped escort us to lunch. Oh my gosh. I never thought we'd make it out of that crowd. Wow, I wonder who called the security guards. I did. Catnip King. Oh, Bernice, good to see you were thinking, Ed. Oh no, she's, she thinks she's smarter than me. Well, it's been like this all day. Everywhere I go, I've attracted crowds. I didn't know that. Unlike some people, I've been working... Unlike some people, I've been working on the campaign trail all day. I've been working around. I got us in... Oh, he's playing Paladins. Well, we're on the CNN in the day of the primary? That's great. Yeah, great. Thanks, Bernice. Why should I always do anything better than me? I called in the food orders ahead of time. That way lunch can be as short as possible and we can get back to campaigning right away. Thanks, you ordered my usual? Of course. Hope you ordered me a salad. Hope you ordered me a salad. Um, no I didn't. We're ordering from a sushi place. Sushi! Ugh. I don't even like cooked fish. It's my favorite. Oh no, I'm sorry I didn't mean to salt you. It's just 
That's okay, Kelsey. Why don't you and I have dinner tonight? Just the two of us. Really? And then you thank you for coming to the had idea. It really saved my campaign. That's so great. I'd love to have dinner with you. Oh, Bernice. What is that, Bernice? Nothing. Let's get the food. Oh, Bernice is getting jealous. What was about? Was is she jealous of me? Well, she should be jealous of me. I have a date with Kale tonight. Oh my gosh, it's really a date. What if he has feeling for me? That'd be so awesome. But you never want to date a ditzy girl like me who makes someone smarter or more experienced. Like Bernice, still a girl can dream, right? It's gonna be my new one. Still, like six o'clock. The polls close at seven five. We can read the, di the results together. I'm pretty sure they'd be good, whatever they were. Oh, and they were. What does it say now? You're leading the minority candidates with 5% of the votes. Good, good. When other districts are reporting, it's up there now. You're up to 8%. No, 10%. Double digits? That's great. Looks you're neck and neck with DJ Nibbles. That makes sense. He's from South Carolina. Everyone expects him to take the stakes since he's the hometown hero. I don't care. You deserve to win. You are a hit. I think it's updating again. Well, no, I just got an email from Greta. She says she doesn't know how to send emails and needs help. I just send you one on here. I don't know. It's weird. Anyway, turn my phone to silence. No. I don't want anything else to distract this from my dinner. During our celebration dinner, we need to celebrate your genius. I'm not a genius. I'm just a normal girl who happens to get lucky. After all, I'm with you right now. There's nothing lucky about being with me. Oh, but there is. I'm very lucky to spend time with you. On, with you, you're just a wonderful cat, and you're a wonderful campaign manager. I wouldn't be last place right now. You, you need to hard yourself. If, I think you can win, no matter who your campaign engineer is. You're that great of a candidate. Really? Yeah, sure. The hat may have gotten everybody's attention, but it was you that held your atten their attention. Yeah, but you. Broke the original dam and got everyone's attention. I can't thank you enough. I'm sure this dinner won't be enough. Where are we going? You're the woman of the hour. You pick. Overcooked meals, really? Uh, but we can't go. We... That's cracked and missing a wheel. I feel so dang. I feel so dangerous to get for one of those. You're joking, right? This is all we not a joke for me. What would you like to go? How about a nice restaurant? You're on. Well, jokes. Oh, the Chapelle. Cats are amazing. One cat bumps into the front of the waiting line. It's how the Le Grand to have Dick Fame's politician hat in the restaurant. Oh, this is the same thing that we ate with, um, the one with, um, Dr. Nom Noms. Oh, that's so cool. I think. Or, or have we eaten here before? I don't remember. So, what do you think? Well, I think it's super classy. Way better than I'm what it used to. But they don't give out food and docky bags here either. He Probably not. I love the picture of his cats on the wall. So atmospheric. The only cat I want to look at you is Kale. Kale's assistant. That is wrong. I can't. What's wrong? I'm a bad cat. What? You're not. Please, Kale. Tell me that's wrong. He's actually so strange and fidgety. That's fitching twitching like crazy. What could be causing this? I'm sorry, i just nervous because I don't know how to say this. We've known each other for a month, right? Yeah, I mean, almost. That kid and cat use that's six months. For me, it's been quite a while. It feels like we've really gotten to know each other in that time. You know what I'm saying. i become dedicated to you, Gail. You're practically all I think of. You're practically all I think of. For fun, for fun, for your, your smile, your effort, everything that makes you, you. I love you, Kale's assistant. Yes, I love you too, Kelly. You do? Yes, I've known for days now, but I've been too shy to admit it. That's a relief. I was worried. Why are you been mad and quit the campaign if I told you how I felt? Yes, the cats are in my control. Yes. I'm gonna shut me from. Is that your phone? I thought I put it on silent. What is? Hey, don't pull out your phone. We're in a restaurant. I just want to check. Oh my gosh! What is it? You won the primary. I did. In the first place of 56 percent of the. Vote is Kale. We did it. We won. Oh, he kissed me passionately. I didn't care that we were in public. Man of my dreams. Even the man of my dreams turned to be a cat. It was finally paying off. Kale at the bottom of the polls to having the top paramation shot. Question is, could we keep this momentum? We learned to keep our hearts open and our windows shut, and we come up with a brilliant plan. Look at everything being so great, owner. I couldn't believe it. Got with Kale. Good morning, Kale's assistant. Good morning. Ah, what are you doing in my bedroom? You invited me to sleep in your dresser drawer last night, remember? I did, I mean... Oh yeah, you're right. I'm sorry, I'm not that straightforward when it comes to romance. Ah, don't worry, think about 
is new to me and you're not comfortable with me, we can move out we can move at your place. Your pace. Thank you, Kill. You're so understanding. Can I uh pet you? Sure. I pet a kill in the back. He's so smart and smooth. <laughs> Are you purring? Yes, it makes me happy when you pet me. It makes me happy too. Now get out. What? I have to change out my pajamas and get ready for today. Oh, okay. I have to get out and change get some breakfast myself. See you later, kitty. Is he Diddy? Diddy? Oh my god, this is my dream come true. I got three cats. Got three cats. Oh, just call me cutie. Isn't that Swedish? I thought being a campaign manager would be fun. I had no idea it would lead to romance. I quickly got changed and stopped my hair. An extra fancy dude from it. An extra fancy dude. Good morning, Kale's assistant. You're in a real good mood considering what happened last night. What do you mean? Last night we went on a date and. And, oh. Uh, that's right, I've forgotten. You've been interrupted by. Bernice. She said that CNN wanted to follow up and review with Kale. Now that he was official winner. Kale turned her down because he was busy with me. Not, she was not happy, and neither were the news people. That ruined the entire evening, but I didn't care. Just happy to be with him. Oh, I told you. That doesn't matter. All that, mean, all that matters is you're the winner of the primary. So what's next on the campaign agenda? So what's a funny name? I remember the history. Is it that a uh, funny name? If I remember history class... Um, correctly. Super Tuesday, Fat Tuesday, Super Fat Tuesday. Sometimes I can't tell if you're joking or not, Kale's assistant. They got rid of a Super Tuesday a hundred years ago. They did, but it was my favorite holiday. Hey, ha, now I can tell you you're joking. I can tell you you can joking now. So is there something that can happen after they decide only cats can run for office instead of holding primaries in every state they decide that primaries only be holding three most important states? Blue Cross your cats are one of the most three important states in the country? Yes, of course. Why wouldn't it? Um. <laughs> you need to get a new book. Joker for cats, I don't remember the difference between Blue Cross and Vermont. Thanks for coming in. They're so close together. How can they get the general one being one of the biggest streets? They can call it New Vermontshire. Same with the, all the tiny streets. This is Jordan Forest become a super state. Just like watching that TV show I watched as a kid. Super state saving the day. Super state don't get its way. Are you singing? Um. Sing because you make me so happy. Glad you're my boyfriend. It's us, wait. We're glad we're together too. Getting back to the primaries though. Oh, it's two of the three primaries. They go into the general elections. You won South Carolina, so that's good. Who won the other two primaries? I remember them from the first debate. Dr. Nom Noms. Hey, Dr. Nom Noms! And. Thunderpaw! The best cat in the world! Oh jeez, not that guy again. Thunderpaw! 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 Two are going down, you can't. Gonna be defeated, there's no way you can win against the Might. That is Thunderpaw! He's gonna take your hat, which is awesome hat by the way. Do good going and crush it with his Thunderpaw! Thunderpaw is yesterday's news. The future's all kale! Yeah, Shark Claw Nat National Convention is gonna pick me to be their candidate. You wait and see. You just wait and see. When Thunderbird's in the White House, you be on the streets. You can do garbage cans. Don't talk about my boyfriend that way. Boyfriend. Please tell me I heard wrong. It's true. Bernice, Kale assistant and I are dating out. I was going to tell you later today. Maybe you don't get the message. Like the email that, that you that keep on putting out. You stay out of the way of this. How dare you try to win Kale's affections. Don't you know that he loves me? Get real, Bernice. He loves me. But I know no longer. I had 10 months to win his affections and you failed. Now it's my chance to win. Guess what? I already did. Lost my chance at true love. Now I'm never gonna get married. If that's not true. I'm sure there's a great guy for someone like me. You gotta be kidding. You're rude and obnoxious. Thank you. That wasn't a compliment, you lunkhead. Arguing with each other. Kayla, however, looked worried. That didn't go very well. What do you mean? Bernice has been in this campaign since day one. She was really that we're dating. What if all my supporters feel the same way? This is just jealous. Pretty sure you're op op open mind, but you're dating your campaign manager. Are you sure maybe we should keep our relationship a secret? Trust me, having a secret list is sure prior away to destroy a political career. And besides, you don't want don't you want people to know about us? 
That is, I don't want to keep it a secret. I love you enough through people to prove they don't matter. That's right, the only thing that matters is our love. And the National Convention. What do we have to do for that? Meet up with the party leaders and they pick up with the presidential candidate is. Really? I thought the candidates were decided by the way the people voted. Ha <laughs> ha, that might have been true a hundred years ago. In that sense, the Tushi campaign. The Tushi campaign? Did you learn about that in history class? No, our class did not get past the Civil War. None of the kids learned. None of the kids learned anything that happened in the past hundred years. Oh, well, that was back when they had primary in each state. Bianca won 30 states. Abraham Lincoln, Lenixon won 15, and Tushy only won 5. But Tushy was the party favorite, so they picked her to go on general elections. People refused and almost revolted, so I switched to the new system and only had three primaries. That makes sense, I guess. Who the party favorite was? One of the sharp ladies like me. Me? Leonard Paul or Dr. Nanoms? I don't know why, but I odds in your favor. How? To, to the hot store! And the challenger posters, and we're trying to make everything better with hats. Da, 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 da. Two more chapters! Yeah! Yeah! Uh, that's perfect on you. How about this one? Ooh, I like that one too. That one's the best. I'll be sure to win. Which reminds me, I checked the news. It's gonna try by winning a smear campaign against you. That's pretty much what I expected out of him. Dr. Nonobs is not caning him up all. He went home and had a sandwich for lunch. Maybe he's so confident winning that he doesn't. And he thinks he doesn't have to wait. No, he's gonna be this. That would do. We got hat power. And you're great debate skills. It's in debate. All I'm doing is meeting with the party leaders. The meeting is at 1 p.m., right? They meet us with each separately in a, for a few hours. You're sure I can't come along? No, you can't. This is an audition that gets made behind closed doors. But that's not fair. I'm your campaign manager. I should be allowed to attend. Sorry, if you want to attend something, you can attend the. But the American students have the same exact time and the same exact temp. Man, no thanks. I'll just wait for you to finish. I hope you have good luck. Luck? This awesome found outfit. I don't need luck. Vision the National Convention. I'm just about time at the hotel room. Nervous. Oh, no, you're kidding. Nervous the whole time. Would he win? Would he lose? I don't know because I had no idea who would be doing the voting. It's okay. He voted on party lines. Right? I'm sure that we'll like him. Maybe he should mention sh scratching pushes just to be on the safe side. Kills a good speaker. Obviously, I'm horrible when it comes to job interviews. The last time, um, asked me what, asked me what my biggest weakness was, and I thought he was asking a different question, and I interrupted and shouted, George Washington! I got all the things mixed up in the interview. I took the money for food. I thought customer service when he gave, uh, customers a deep tissue massage when they were waiting in the checkout line. Needless to say, I didn't get that job at the post office, especially in, especially since the job is supposed to be at the grocery store. I don't know why the interview's problems though. The grocery store needs massages. Clerks need massages too. Wait, that's it. Get the party leaves a massage. They need to vote for sure. I'm blood babbling. Can't handle this. I'm too nervous. I need to do something this time. I should get to make a sign for sale that sound that says, Congratulations, Kale. Because he's going to win. What a great idea. My son went back to the convention area. It's actually kind of neat. I was gather to see their next presidential no nominee was. Big announcement. <coughs> and the winner is Dr. Nom Noms. The winner is Dr. Pa. Winner South Carolina, Kale. I should be the nominee. Kale's an idiot. And Dr. Anonymous isn't pe actually paying attention. What's going on? Huh? What was that? Did I miss something? Hello, everybody. It's an honor to be in front of you today. Party leaders, I met and they picked the cat. It's most likely the party to victory. So let's see newest candidate. Kale! Yeah! Kale! Yeah! Yeah, Kale! I lost. How is this possible? The people who pick Kale must be in it. Oh good, my campaign ends here. I can go home now. I won, I mean, uh, I won, yes! Yes! Kale! 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 
Kale, Kale, Kale! That was it, the big event that I worked so hard for, but he looked sad. Kale, 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 Kale. He was busy for the rest of the night, tired of people and taking photographs. He didn't come back to the hotel till 11 o'clock. Number one candidate. Phew, I finally got away. You're back late. You're back late. It's like everybody in, this, in the convention wanted to talk to me. I've never been so popular. Why do you look so sad? Is this what you wanted? It is, but I think I know where they picked me uh, over the others. It's because the other political parties picked Frederica as their candidate. Who's Frederica? Think of her as my exact opposite. She's an angry shaved cat who doesn't approve of fur or hats. Well, it's like your opponent is your evil twin. I think that's why they picked me. In politics, it's good to pick somebody who's as different as possible from the competition. It makes it easier to draw comparisons. So this is Frederica. She must be a what? A Democrat? Republican? Those are political parties. But then a long time ago, when it was revealed that they were funded by the same people. Oh, sorry. So Frederica is a member of the F FF, the Fancy Furball Party. She's spent the last 10 years in Congress. Wow, expensive, a very experienced leader. And you can bet she's going after me since I'm the first term senator. She seems that he's grace and experience, not youth and tacky hats. Your hats look amazing. But Frigga thinks all hats are awful. She tried to ban hats. She tried to ban hats, mustaches, and beards last year. Well, that's a little extreme, but I'm pretty sure you're overreacting. She'll probably be on the clean campaign. Hope so. I don't like to engage dirty politics. Jeff for I looked up for the recall on my phone. She looked like a mean cat, the person you wouldn't want to meet in the dark alleyway at night. There's a lot of links here. Frigga for president, for victory center. Frigga launches new attack ads. What was that last one? Frigga launches a series. On her opponent till mere hours after his nomination, first attack, first re first attack scales records. And the second attack, and the third way doesn't add and insults me. Uh oh. Watch it. That's it. I'm watching this. The play button on my phone. The ad started. Oh my gosh, that's right. Kale. The editor doesn't do anything. Besides a place in a letter box. They had fired his staff and replaced him with a brainless idiot who never made it to college. Why? He fell in the SATs because she misspelled her own name. Well, that, that's slander. I can exp I can explain that. Her other achievements, including accidentally gluing her nose to a light bulb and getting kicked out of the local zone from running around naked, singing Polly Wally Doodle. No fear of bringing that up. That's what I happened when I was three at the pool thing, that is. The live bonus thing was last week. That's the kind of person Kayla supports. Cause he's so desperate he'll hide anyone. As long as they work for free. That reminds me, how much are you paying me? We'll discuss that later. Really want a fair like that running our country? No, a hundred times no. Vote for someone with dignity and experience. Vote for Frederica. Paid by the kale. Pay for the kale's assistant who is an idiot who must be stopped by an organization. It doesn't look like that even exists. You want something like this. Oh, what is it? It says here that the leader of the government is my ex boyfriend, Bill, the one who dumped me for a Really mean reason. I'm sorry, Kales. This isn't this is all my fault. No, it's not. It's Frederica's. But I'm the reason you're involved with this. Maybe the committee was right. Maybe I should let you go. What? No. The, what committee? Party leader. They want me to use one of the professionals' campaign managers for the general election. They're too much of a wild card. I'm not a wild card. I'm I'm always smart and sensible. You're a wild. No, you're a wild card. But that's okay. I love you for it. Oh well, dang it, scale, but serious. They want you, me, to, you to replace me? That's horrible. Yeah. Try to talk them out of it, but agreed I to add three of their managers to my team. Three? You brought three people in to do my job? I didn't have a choice if they give it this way. You have a lot of free time now with three people handling the campaign. Why, I bet they pretty much do all the work for you. That's a good point, but so I find this harder to believe. Me too. In the primaries, I thought everything had ended when we lost. And the things were just beginning. Can I handle this? Attack ads for Vrika, a group of new sharp claw employees um, guiding the campaign as they see fit. These things worried me, but I knew they couldn't stop. It had to be before there for Kale, no matter what happens. We could get it to through it together. Last one, we go to Paw to Paw for Vrika and find and find out who the next cat president will be. Will he become the final? Catch president. I mean, will he, will he'll break the record. No, I can't do it. I can't do it. Kill. You have to. Now I can't decide. There's too many options. Just pick one. 
No, you pick one, because I won't. Absolutely refuse to. Why are you so stretch about picking a vice president? Because if I pick the wrong cat, it could ruin the entire campaign. You're exaggerating. I learned about this stuff in high school, and you're supposed to, that compliments you. So you're strong on the things you're weak on. That's not how things work anymore. Really? How are vice presidents like today? Popular vice president picks the crazy, is the crazy person. Some who's stupid or ridiculous or both. Someone who's no way qualified to lead the country. I don't understand. It's popular to pick a horrible person as a VP? Yeah, helps preference, assassinations, and the like. Anyone who dislikes me wouldn't want to get rid of me. Because I know my replacement would be a hundred times worse. What other types of vice presidents are there? Because the vice president secretly wants to steal your job, the butt kissing VP who does everything you say, the VP that 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 you send to do your random errands while you stay home and watch TV. Like, what kind of random errands does a president have? Tons. Everyone wants to meet with the president, but he's soon avoiding they'll stop inviting your events. No, I never thought of that way, because it's pretty much it's pretty important. So you agree, what type of vice president should I pick? Hmm. Can we nominate humans for the VP? Only cats can be politicians, so they have to go undergo the human to cat surgery first. Great, I have the perfect person in mind. Hmm. Crazy person. Classic. Crazy person. Makes you super good in comparison. Do you have anyone else in mind? Hmm, Lizzie. Kale won't fail. Vote for Kale. Vote for Kale. He's the best cat who ever lived. I want to be his vice president pick. Kale all the way. Thanks, Kale assistant. That's a huge weight off my shoulder. I'm happy to do whatever I can to help. But if you change your mind and decide to pick me as your VP, I won't complain. You're so cute. I love it when you make jokes like that. Ahem. <clears throat> If you took a stop being kissy kissy for a moment, we have important work to accomplish. Accomplish here. We aren't getting kissy kissy. What's the news, Bernice? More tech ads from Frederica. Rica. National distinguished and famous floods in three countries. Winning the Miyama the Mubel Peace Award. If I'm allowed to add the GPD to dump, even triple, plus I built a machine that takes carbon from air and use it to power hover crowds. They're 100% fuel efficient and they ha even have cup holders. Compare that to the sharp claw candidate Kale. He, once he got stuck inside a cup holder. Not true! It's a fool and disgrace to this country. If he's elected, he'll do all the progress that the fancy furballs have achieved over the last 15 years. Kale's an imputed obstructionist who does everything his evil or lords. Overlord tells him, not true, Kale doesn't do everything I say. <laughs> well, I once ate cafeteria food for three days and I can't even and I can't even stomach Kale. He's what's the worst thing about Kale? Isn't his inexperience or his love of cauliflower? No, it's his hat. My my hat? She cannot be insulting your hat. Hats are stupid and pointless. No self respect should ever wear them on. You should notice I see the same tired hats on the right. Frankly, it's pathetic. As he's overcompensating for his inability to do anything correctly. That would be my guess. I'm Frederica, and I'm delighted to prove this message. Pay for the. Like, cause Kill Hat is dumb. P.S. Kill Hat is dumb. Really dumb. No! Took the struggle's point of your campaign and mercilessly stepped on it. And they're right, that's the worst part. No, they're, they're right. No, your hat is awesome. Get real. I'm running for president. You think I can win the stoke of a good hat? My is gonna be a science of the trash in Canada history. I remember, even when my name is mentioned in trivia nights. That is not true. You're gonna be remembered as one of the greatest presidents this country ever had. Besides, you're remembered by your kittens. You're pregnant? How is it even possible? What are you talking about? Of course I'm. Oh, I phrased that badly. Let me try again. You'll be remembered by our family. That's gonna take that leap and have a family together. If you don't want that to tell kid, I mean. And I should, probably shouldn't say anything. Well, I didn't know that you were that serious. Why wouldn't I be serious? It's a long term. Just like your president, so you can't pay. You're too sweet trying to treat me so I never thought about having kids. You can't. It's a biological impossible. Get out of here, Bernice. It's a couple times now. Tch, whatever. He's right. The only way we could have children through is a surgery gate. Would you rather, or should I, uh, not spoil the mood? But this is kind of making me uncomfortable. Oh, yeah, right. Sorry. He, I guess we could both say awkward things I'm sometimes committed to this relationship. I wish I was deeply committed to my presidential campaign. Hey, the polls show you're winning a lot of states. That's good. Yes, but that's to be expected. We only know most of the votes will be. We do? Yes, for example, no buyers can be in California. There's no point. 
they've been voting for fancy football since the beginning of time. So we're running a campaign. It's almost like a state that state does not count, not just one. And if it's the same between past elections, so that means we already know what they'll vote for. Are you saying that the election will be decided by one or two states? Yep, both on the East Coast. That explains why it's been our campaign in those two states. Yes, but it's not for us. Us advertising and one of our latest attack ads. We make a counter attack ad. We're going to follow our friend in the winter. You're supposed to do that in the summer. That'd be Pity means battle importantness, so it's good. So it's good politics. I perhaps, but I don't want to sink down to her level. Hmm. You should run some ads to show off how good you are. I mean, we haven't been doing that. I think we have. Our campaign is for the start. Don't let to share the information with me. Being a bush, here they come now. Sorry to enter the club. Interrupts. We came to fix the problem. What? Kale, come with us. We have villagers underfoot. Hey, Kale and I are about to solve the problem together. Our apologies. This is a job for serious campaign managers, not first timers. Being meanies. It's okay, Kale's assistant. I'll see you later, okay? How? Why is he almost as big? Okay, I guess. <clears throat> One of the Sharp Globs campaign managers. I'll say I confuse and doubt, but what can happen next? What will be your future be? How this campaign and all I can do is hope for the way best. Based on your response to the game, you unlocked. What did I unlock? The good ending! Decided to hold a press conference that night. It was big news. Almost all the major news stations were here. Kill dress up for the occasion with the fanciest. Hat in his wardrobe. His wardrobe was sizable at this moment, as I bought him over 20 hats. I'd also sent him lots of hats, free of charge. It was a hat shaped like Kill wearing a hat. It was so cute. So, we're ready to begin. Ladies and gentlemen of this country, cats and kittens, everyone, thank you for listening. I'm holding to announce my strategy for the presidential race. Recently, I met a parent with a series of vicious attack hats, which insult my character, my policies, my hat, and my girlfriend. This is going too far. I will not put up with somebody who publicly insults Kale's assistant. I love her and nothing will change that. I tried again to be an upright, honest campaign. I could easily insult Frederica's family, her, fur, her four failed ma managers, and, the, ones, and the fact that she wants Miss Feld's cat. I could easily say that her forehead is wrinkled more than an elephant, and her foreign policy was designed by a two-year-old, and her tax advisors have history of breaking the law. But I won't mention any of those things. That would be rude. I'm Kale, and I'm, I'm running a king clean from the bank. For he is, here, is here trying to win by hook or crook, but I'm trying to win with integrity. If you want a candidate who's honest, it, honest vote for me. If you want a scoundrel, vote for Freak. That's all I have to say. Are there any questions? Kale, who is your mysterious girlfriend? She's right here. Kale's assistant. Come out with me here on stage. This see your face made me more nervous than I've ever been before. Don't be shy, darling. I'm not sure they love you, mistress. I do. But oh, with you by my side, you can handle anything. Kale, everybody. In a few months, I was just a nobody, trying to get a job in a cruel world. Kale gave me a chance. Nobody else would give me, give me at the time of... When nobody else would give me the time of the day, Kale saw the potential in me. Now I have a real job. I'm happier than I've ever been in all, my whole life, and it's all thanks to Kale. Vote for Kale. He's the perfect candidate. Oh my god. I love you so much, Kale. I love you too, Kale's assistant. We kiss each other. On national TV. The audience, people in the audience, odd. Already boomed after that. Presenting a candidate who they can empathize with, emotion, and what emotion is more powerful than love? Making our news. Love your cat. Love the hat. Vote Kale. Turned it down for some reason. Vote for Kale. His name is Razor Died on the ballot, and you can't spell Kale without ale. Huh? <laughs> like Kale. Help before you. Help for our country. And cat. The choice of cats everywhere. This one with Kale. The place he responds. Uh, and. Uh, the the place he belongs is in the litter box. A uh, matching cat, one for me and for cat. It was so cute. Everybody gushed on how he did cute couple. Steadily rising the, until the night of debate. The debate was rough, but Kale stood firm. Ah, it's so weird. I don't like that. 
Do you want to know name cat like Kale, Kale to run the country? No, you want an experienced candidate like me. Congress has been doing poorly in years. We need a fresh candidate, not more of the same. Tends to be fresh, but Kale's are old fashioned. Give them decades ago because they were tried and failed. On contrary, sometimes the oldest policies are the best policies. That way, they've been around so long, they work. Work. Your economic plan will put everybody out of work. Cannot send another round of altruistry measures. My judgment will not enact altruistry. I merely cut wasteful spending. The budget is as transparent as my skin. Frederica is nothing to hide. I would never hide or back down from a challenge. So my competitors, though, however, have refused to release their records, records publicly. That does it, Kale. Before I do something else, I want to do this. <gasps> hey, where did Kale go? Who's the cattle stage of Fermika? He seems familiar somehow. Maybe he's Frederica's VP? It's like snowflakes or men's hairball. I can't ever between the difference between those two. No, no, that is hat. You see how bold and useless he is without the hat. He is nothing. Cut to commercial. Okay, got it. You can ask for cutting to the to allow candidates the chance to work out their problems. Useless, Kale. Useless. There's also what happened. It wasn't pretty. It's why a bunch of memes and cat pictures, but nothing of substance. Kale and Frisco are pulling out the same exact numbers with the no change to approval ratings either. Kale's three minute, three minute speech, the one that and how the whole could, there was a North Ode speech and only quoted four words in the, from the first sentence. Still, they got the quotation out of context. I feel like an idiot because it took me two weeks to write that speech. But once toward boom, the popularity extreme by 15% why Kale's no, there's that to comfort. There's nothing I can do. Kale, I'm sorry. Don't be. You weren't the one who humiliated in front of me, the entire crowd. My country. Can we rebound from this? Maybe with another hat. Don't you get the meme? Kale's assistant. Hats aren't going to cut it anymore. They were nothing but a gimmick. A stupid joke. No hey, Kale, don't yell at me like that. Sorry, I just... Just leave me alone. I don't want to talk to anyone. Okay, Kale. I was failing. How could I help him? How could I save his campaign? What about this? I begin to sink. Kill, kill is my cat. He's running to be president. Hope you win. And bring the tailspins because she's quite arrogant. And I ran. Turn out campaign with a nervous hat. You think it's great, but all this fate, he needs to put his in hat. Kale, kill, I love you. I want you to win this campaign, but you need something else than a hat on the floor. When it says you're mundane, kill, kill is the best. You stand up all the rest. If I can't help you, be wonderful. Well, there's no doubt. Help you succeed in your quest. It made me feel better to help Kale's campaign. I need something, anything I believe Kale standing is worse than war after that wardrobe mishap. I'm gonna have him wanted by a pet store. Sales pet clothes. Did you say pet clothes? Yep, we got Halloween costumes. Make your sweaters on. They're nice, but. Wait, is that a fancy feline boto? Is it an original kit on? I will buy it immediately. They look silly, but if not, anyways, an idiot difference after the debate. About the debate, about the debate. And they kill a sharp claw. Kill, dude, is is that you? Awesome bow tie, bro. Thank you. It is an amazing bow tie. Just how I'd be an amazing person. Bow ties are even dumber than hats. Are you crazy, Frederick? It's, it's a katan. How can you top that? I, I. I'll be ban all pet clothing if elected president. For being more fashionable than you, is that the type for future generation? The international community is really going happy after. You know, I guess you should not mess with Kale's bow tie. Allegiance to Kale that night, all because of his amazing bow tie. And when he picked out a novelty T-shirt too. He was unstoppable. Just a more attack as opposed to like and taking 83% of the vote. He won by a landslide. You did a kill. You won. No, we won. We won. You're being honest again. You're the one who, the cat won the president. See, not me. No, that's not what I meant. I mean, what, we were going to do this together. Because, well, I've been waiting for this for a long time. Guess assistant. Will you murmur it? I, you're... Posing now? I don't want to ask till after the campaign was over. It's over now. What do you say? Yes, 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 yes. It'll be a rush to have everything completed in the inaugurated date, but we can make it work. No, I have a better idea.
I got married in the days of these ones. It was the happiest day of our lives. Four years earning to catch it together. We grew the education and Kale's a hat for every child plan helped reduce poverty to record lows. I nominated I got nominated for for country British environment. However, Kale won the prize the way he ended the he ended the Dogonio Persian conflict. He met every one of his goals during this first term. He didn't even bother to seek about his election. Um, but he couldn't have won it. But he, I bet. He could have won by a one side, I'll bet. But he wanted to live out his retirement happily. Help me raise our two adorable children. One, two kittens and one baby. So that I chose to work with Kale. It was the best decision of my life. I've never been so happy. Thank you, Kale. Thank you, Kale, for so much you've done. I love you more than you ever know. Or maybe. No, you did no, because you love me just as much. That's the end of the story. That's how I got married. The love of my life and became part of one of the America's greatest cat presents ever. But now, hey. but now, you gotta go look at the bad ending, Kale. Look at the normal ending first. of his visor, a series of attack ads against Frederica. Frederica says he's a fancy fur ball. She's lying. She doesn't even have fur. Kill on the other hand, is covered by a thick, luscious fur. Top of the amazing hat, and he's cleared the cat to leave this country. Vote for Kale in the election. You'll be glad you did. I'm Kale, and I literally approve this ad. You're supposed to be you wholeheartedly approved. But I don't approve of the attack ads. I don't want to win the president bad. Telling the competition, I want to win because I'm a better candidate. Are you a better candidate? Yes, I've overcome terrible odds and fought difficult schedules. We from a campaign from the comforts of our own mansion. I am the cat who's been out on the streets, working every every day to make ends meet. Frederica, she's a pampered princess, but for kill, a hardworking cat. I'm not ashamed to wear a hat. Like I like it's like it's getting behind the president's candidate. It's good for enough for the millions of Americans. It's it's good enough for me. Vote for Kale, just like you, only as a cat. If elected, I promise to fight justice and prove communication, not take cat naps in between Senate meetings. It's boring, but still to it. Vote Kale, he's willing to do things others are not. If I'm elected, I promise to narrate as well, 15%. I'm vote. I'm fine for you, Kale. If elected, I plan to maintain the financial of my producers. Vote for Kale. Those are the right, those, things are pretty good right now. It makes things stay that way. Vote for Kale. The turtle that won't enact any major changes. I'm not a turtle. I am a cat. It's just an expression. Not a nice expression. Vote for Kale. He doesn't understand how expressions work. <laughs> then it went all that for several hours. It was junk. But no, but some of it made for good advertisements. Do you think it will be enough to win the election? I don't know. All we can do is hope it works. Maybe we should want to run an ad explaining the history you have. So it will help people understand how you committed to the cat cop, but I'm not committed. The only reason is because you brought it for me. Aw, oh, it's so cute. How do you... The fact that it also helps my approval ratings is a huge plus. Hey, maybe you could buy me a hat, then we could be matching! And why would you stop there? We wore hats and march on clutch and equal rights for hats. That's going a little bit overboard. I guess you're right. We gave everyone a bad case of hat hair. Um, I just want to see how it ends. I should never wear hats. He's in, to the entire species. People refer as is who gather them with integrity. Who do you trust? Cats who want to show what he looks like? Or cat? A, a, a cage frozen hat. My budget will cut wasteful spinning. Which is a transparent as Mexican. Frederica has nothing to hide. She's always trying to insult me in my campaign. The fact that deep down she wishes she had her own hat. I have the sun hat to cover up her skin. Her administration will not give another's it will not give itself another pain case. I'm going to take a pay cut. Cat fight between check the results. And there was nothing. I mission being this, but it was the same. Afraid to fly, literally. Ready by Wokinus. I just want to do this. <gasps> Where did Kale go? Okay, so we already seen this. He's restless. I should be taking a vision. We want Kale. We want kill. We want kill. Give me back that, you violent maniac. Yay, kill back. Hooray. Yeah. Weirdest debate I've ever attended. I'm just saying I've attended like three of them, I think. I forget. We campaign. Not because we did any better, but because the figures started pulling worse. Our true colors that night. It wasn't pretty. 
It wasn't pretty either. I mean, it's okay if you like Henrique, uh, Hairless Cats, but give me Gorgeous Kill. But give me Gorgeous Kill any day of the week. And Kale, he wore the way the dispatch was afraid to go all the way to the White House. Who did he pick as the first lady? Yeah, you can bet for that one up. But if you want to you know, unlock the good ending. Ha, that's funny. So, let's try to do the bad ending now. Aw. That's why so nice. Well, we're beginning to be. Begin, where, where's Kale's hat? It's the country's cats and kids everywhere. Thank you for listening. Most of I've just got anything else. Decided to end my bid for the president's so yeah, like, wait, what? I quit the race. I'm a butt-faced lizard. No! Right here, I'm being replaced by Thunderpaw. He's quitting? Huh, I guess. Woo, Thunderpaw all the way. He's back, baby. Thunderpaw, 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 Thunderpaw. How's this possible? I loved Kale. But to all my supporters, this is the right thing to do. So when we're going to get a sharp claw into the White House. I'm... Um, I'm the cat for the job. Sniffles. Tries openly. No, poor Kale. Go away, it has been the sage for Thunderpaw. It's a big campaign strategy. Paying attention. One person. Call doctor. Kale, hold up! Hey, hello. Am I telling me what that about? Earlier today, you were already a winner, race. Now you're quitting? She calls me when you quit. They tell me it's best for the party. Thunderbolt Claw is better equipped to handle the attacks. I don't believe this. They fired you just because you're running a clean campaign? That's not exactly what happened, but yes, I refuse to sink. So, does this mean your political future? Yes, I'm going back to be a sinner. When my term is up, I won't seek re-election. I'll retire in obscurity. And what about me? Where do I fit into that picture? Kills assistant. I love you and you're great. But you can... you can... Hold you down. I'm gonna leave. You can find a new job. But you, you can't leave. I love you. It's the best. <laughs> to the president to loop. You're not a loser, you're you're I want you to have this. Your hat. Your hat? You can remember the good times we had. The love we shared. Goodbye, Kale's assistant. Goodbye, Kale. Guys. There's all Kale again. Heck I picked out picked out from Sad I thought I couldn't do anything. I'll look at the hat. Remember the times I shared with Kale. Remember to smile, move on with my life. That's what Kale did. That's what he would want from me. I quit my job in politics again. Stamp Kim organizing. I'm happy, but I can't help but wonder what if I made different choices? Better choices? Maybe Kale would have won the election. Well, that's all, guys. Hope you enjoyed. So, we um, looked at. Uh, we finished Kale. We got the good ending, thank goodness, because I liked. So we gotten three, all three of them. Well, no, actually, two of them have gotten the uh, good ending. Um, we haven't done Thunder Paw, Rover. Tell us what we're gonna do next: Thunder Paw, Rover, or DJ Nibbles. We got three left. We got half of it done. And so yeah, hope you enjoyed. Goodbye, and as always, stay determined.